Hey there, I've got a couple of 130 millimeter Wenger knives to show you. These are both from the Dave Arnold collection. And like so many knives from his collection, these are pretty special. They're hard to come by and they're quite collectible. So the first one we're going to look at is the Mike Horn Ranger. This is its original case. And you'll see this knife um, does have a bit driver in the handle. So the drivers actually resided in the case. Now Mike Horn, if uh, you're not familiar with him, is a South African adventurer who's done a lot of amazing things. Uh, one is he circumnavigated the globe at the equator. He swam the entire length of the Amazon. Uh, this knife he actually used a prototype of in his four-year Pangaea expedition where he went around the globe. And the uh, first thing you'll notice is that uh, the handle material is a little different. Uh, Mike Horn apparently is very... Uh, um, uh, eco-conscious, so he wanted this made out of uh, recyclable, uh, renewable materials. So there's a lot of certified wood in this and it's all uh, renewable and recyclable. Um, it does have uh, a special stamp on it. It says Mike Horn and it uh, shows part of his journey there, I guess. It's a big knife and a couple things are special about it. First of all, the locking blade is a blunt-nosed serrated blade, so it's almost like an emergency blade. It is one hand opening and it's locking and it uses this uh, really fine locking system where you press the winger emblem. Uh, it's really easy to use. The other uh, blade is just a regular straight edge blade and it's non-locking. But in between that you have a very nice set of pliers and these are very robust pliers and uh, it's really cool the way they fold in there and fold away. They're needle nose, but you know that you can uh, handle larger nuts here, and there is a wire cutting feature as well. Now there is sort of a uh, another layer over here that has a can opener, which would come in handy on an expedition, right? There's no screwdriver, cap lifter. Instead, here there is a metal saw or file. So I'm sure Mike Horn was instrumental in developing the tools that are available on this knife, and I'm not really sure why he picked this particular set, but I'm sure it helped him with his gear on the expedition. This is an interesting tool. It's, it's, it looks like a Phillips driver at first, but it's a, um, more like a reamer sacking needle. It's very sharp on this edge. Winger later made a knife that was very similar to this. Um, I believe it was the Ranger Grip 90, but they subbed in the wood saw instead of the emergency blade. So that's the Mike Horn Ranger from Winger in its original case. And here we have another 130 millimeter Winger knife. It's also very special. This is an addition for the Alpine Club in Switzerland. And the Alpine Club is apparently the organization that maintains climbing huts in Switzerland and uh, who you uh, work with if you're going to stay at the climbing huts. So also a very cool knife. This one uh, is, again, one hand opening, the large partially serrated locking blade. And then it has the full opening layer, screwdriver, cap lifter, wire bender can opener. It has a wood saw and a set of pliers. And an inline Phillips. On the back it has a screwdriver a corkscrew rather and they all So that's a, that's a uh, four layer knife, 130 millimeter. Again, specially made for the Swiss uh, Alpine Club, Alpine Club Switzerland. Hard to find. Two really special knives from the Dave Arnold collection. Thank you for watching.